the public transportation industry getting a major facelift. This as executives seek to implement a digital bus system in New Providence dubbed UPTC Jitney Pass. The initiative is expected to provide access to 220 buses traversing over 40 routes. Providing a smart routing system so persons can actually know where you are and where you want to go when catching the bus. This is predominantly one of the biggest issues when catching the bus, as I found here in Nassau. You may hear about the number 11 or the number 10 and number 15, but you don't really know which direction they're running or where their bus stops actually are. That's John Bridgewater, co-founder of Bluestones Lab, the digital company that's partnering with the United Public Transportation Company to implement this new transportation system. Here's what he says residents can expect. One of the features includes the setting up a smart routing system in a typical ride sharing like interface that you see with Uber and Lyft. Where you are, where you want to go, shows you the bus in real time, shows you the movement of the bus approaching your bus stop, shows you where the next bus stop is. It actually shows you the ETA of that bus, so you know it's 15 minutes that the bus is going to take to get to you, 10 minutes if it's going to take to get to you if traffic's congested, who the bus driver is, its star rating, and multiple methods of payments. Um, predominantly, it's cash-based right now, but over time, we're looking to phase out cash and implement more digital solutions like QR codes, but the Bahamas Central Bank digital currency signed dollar, top card, top value cards that you'd be able to get at various levels. President of the United Public Transportation, Harrison Moxie, says the new digital system also seeks to remedy several challenges and inconveniences that leave many residents aggrieved. To be able to uh, bring about a better time schedule for busing, and so people will have that more reliability of catching the bus. Uh, this would help to mitigate against the long waits uh, through a scheduled system for busing. And so you will be able to know and also track the buses uh, that you will know where they are. That means if you have to stay out or get off from work late, you don't have to worry that by 6 o'clock you're not going to see a bus. Moxie went on to note that it's also expected to address safety concerns for both drivers and residents. This would be a start for the many robberies and things that bus drivers will have experienced with cash in the system. You know, during the pandemic, uh, we have had, uh, you know, several robberies back to back, you know, gun pulled on bus drivers and all that. So uh, this would give you that confidence that you'll be able to work late, not worrying about having any bulk of cash, you know, in the public service system. With the UPTC Jitney Pass expected to be launched in January, Bridgewater says it will be launched with two focuses. The first is to onboard students. And as we onboard those students that actually catch the bus, we'll be able to provide that safety feature of at least an attendance system within the bus in its first phase. In parallel, we'll be having another pilot to the general public that encompasses more of the routine digital transactions and smart routing systems, et cetera, much more sophisticated technology um, that users, that's very user-friendly to the everyday eye. Jose Etienne, Eyewitness News.